Savior, thank you for taking the time, and my condolences that you had to endure all once bloviating. I've dealt with worse. It sounds like he's really trying to put you over the barrel. The idea that the Karja purposely let Bristlebacks into the dawn, it's, it's completely absurd. But the louder and longer he says it, the more support he'll get for his damned concession decree. How did the Bristlebacks get into the Daunt? No one knows for sure. The first report of them came from west of the quarry. But unless they have wings I don't know about, I don't see how they could have come over the mountains. No other way in. The only way I know about is barren light. Look, if you can get to the bottom of this, I can offer a considerable bounty in return. Help me shut Olvent up. You said the Bristlebacks were first spotted west of the quarry? Yes, according to one terrified laborer, said the ground trembled before they came charging down the hillside. He took off and ran all the way here. Good place to start looking, then. If you learn the truth, maybe Ulvant will stop blaming the Karja for every problem under the sun, and maybe then he'll actually focus on rebuilding Baron Light instead. Javad said the bristlebacks were first spotted west of the quarry. I should see if there's anything in the back of the valley. Dead bristleback, out of falls. Gotta check it out. off the cliff up there. I better keep following the trail up. Smoke from deeper in the mine. An explosion. Bristlebacks. So they did come. They must have gotten trapped. And I have to take them out before I can look around.
Better take a look at where the smoke's coming from. There's a lot of blaze down there. There's a lot of blaze here to blast a mountain open. And there's a note on one of the barrels. It's not addressed to Olvind. Looks like this mine was supposed to be shut down. The must have gotten greedy. Blasting deeper into the mountain. I should let Javad know what I found. news do you bring? Picked up the Bristleback Trail by the quarry. Looks like they stampeded out of a mine at the back of the valley. The mine? How could a herd of Bristlebacks come from there? I'm not sure, but Alvin's workers were using explosives to tap the tunnels inside. For the love of Dawn, I told him it wasn't worth the risk. Those tunnels, they run for miles underground, even beyond the Daunt. No, you don't think that Olven's blasting opened up a passage from the other side? Perhaps. Yes, perhaps. If this is true, we need confirmation. An inquiry so thorough, so irrefutable, endorsed by the Savior. All right, I'll keep looking. I need to go. Of course. You're in the market, Frost. At the embassy, Regala's rebels were riding bristlebacks. And if they attacked from the north, they might have a camp up that way. machines. attached to the bridge. That's oh, one half of the bridge. Another drop the other side. There. Bridge is down.
Bristleback. It looks like it fell into a tunnel. So the rebels were keeping Bristlebacks here. The machines fell into the tunnel, which must have collapsed as they ran further in. What if Olven's explosives created the sinkhole? I should head back to Chainscrape to let Javad know. Returned from the west. Any luck? The bristlebacks were being penned by Tanakh rebels on the other side of the mountains. Alvin's explosives opened up a sinkhole, dropping them into the tunnels. Which they followed to the mine and out into the daunt. Right. Aside from the rebels, if anyone is to blame for the bristlebacks, it's Alvin. Radiant beams of the sun. And all this time he was pointing the finger at us. <clears throat> Bring Olvent here. Petra, too. Summoned like a blasted ale witch. You best be meaning to put pen to parchment. What? Why is she here? I live here too, lug nut. <laughs> so what's this about? <clears throat> Thanks to the savior, the sun has shown the truth on the bristleback incursion. Tanakh rebels were keeping pens of machines on the other side of the mountains. A sinkhole swallowed them, releasing them into the underground tunnels that led east and out into the daunt. So it was an accident. But let us not forget that it was the Karja... I'm not done. The sinkhole only formed due to your unauthorized blasting in the southern mine, Ulvund. You are responsible for the machine rampage, the workers we lost, the destruction the Bristlebacks caused. All of it. My dear Magistrate, has your precious son baked your senses? I would never give such an order without first consulting you. <laughs> uh, evidence says otherwise. Aloy found the shipping manifest in the mine. You skirted the laws of the Sundom Ulvent. All for a few extra shards. And that's not the only mine you've been squeezing. Corvin's crew would have drowned if it weren't for Aloy. <laughs> I... I demand an official investigation. I won't be the victim of some Karja scheme. Certainly. We'll conduct a thorough inquest into everything. The Bristlebacks, the mine. Every business deal you ever put your name to. Well, that... That's not necessary, is it? What if I just return to the claim? Oh, well, that would save the crown the cost. Of course. I'll be on my way as soon as I wrap up some previous commitments, tie up some loose ends. After all, the welfare of Chainscrape's people in a transition like nope, this... Nope, you're leaving right now. Chainscrape will be just fine. You think she can run this scorched out forge dump? Ha! Knock yourself out. Get out! Oh, no. Don't want you! No. Don't need Down you! with all that! <laughs> Get off me! Mud looks good on you, Alvin. <sighs> As the sun burns away, Shadow. Mm. Thank you for that, Aloy. Well, he had it coming. Here. Please accept this token of gratitude. You've done the Sundom and my sanity a great service. And I believe we have some matters to discuss. Guess we do. Not the most pleasant boots to fill, but I'll wear them. All thanks to you, Flame Hair. <sighs> okay. 
Chain scrape will be better off with Petra in charge. Careful there. 